right, so I must say I have been looking forward to this. I... <laughs> obviously. I'm DMT Infinity. Of course I have been. But I'm also, um... <laughs> the one thing about Mitra Giant Species is the fact that it is like whenever you go so long without it, and then you finally have it back in front of you, and then you smell it, and then you're just like, oh, fuck, that's right. <sighs> Time to power through it. <sighs> Let's do it. Of course. Okay, now. Oh, let's go ahead and get right into it. Cheers. Cheers to the spirit of Metrogynus speciosa. Oh my god! Oh! Ah! Mitragina speciosa. Tastes like shit. Feels like heaven. Go pick yourself up some now. Whew, I literally just took that hit and I can already feel the effects coming on. Like, that is one thing that I love so much about Kratom. Now, of course, it affects everybody differently, and some people don't even feel it until like 20, 30 minutes later, whatever, but. As soon as it starts going into my system, I can feel the effect slowly building up. Like, the second that it hits my gut, I can slightly feel my consciousness altering and altering and altering higher and higher and higher until the effects hit the peak. Oh, wow. Oh, and also a little tip for any of you Mitragina species enthusiasts out there. Uh, of course, not everybody's neurological makeup is the same, so this information may just be complete garbage to you. It may not even matter to you, but if it does, then that's why I'm saying it. So if you are also a nicotine addict like myself, be careful when combining Kratom and nicotine, because at least for me personally, it gives me such a bad headache to the point of nausea, and I just end up just throwing up with the Kratom, so it just ends up wasting everything, and I just have a headache, and it just never really ends the way that I want it to anyway, so certainly be careful whenever it comes to mixing nicotine and Kratom, because it's not necessarily going to uh, hurt you in any way, shape, or form, or even necessarily get you to that point of nausea and throwing up. But certainly be careful, take it slowly, and don't do anything in this video just because you see DMT Infinity doing it because, trust me, there's a lot of things that I can do and that I have done and that I will do that would get a lot of people killed, okay? So just because you see DMT Infinity doing it on the internet does not necessarily mean that it is safe for you to do. Nonetheless, I'm going to start editing on a video or maybe work on a song or write a script or film something. I don't know. I'm going to do something because I got a shit ton of energy. So, so far, Green Bailey, a lot of energy. Not really much of the red vein effect, but certainly a lot of the white vein effect. I'm really, really liking this. I'm going to uh, drink on that today and then tomorrow we're going to go to the Yellow Manda and then maybe the day after that we'll go to the Red Vietnam or something like that. We'll, we'll figure it out, but I'm going to go ahead and end the clip here, work on some other content and then update y'all in probably about one to three hours. Alright, next clip. Wow, I must say that the Red Bailey is extremely energizing. Granted, whenever I did pass out, I ended up passing out for quite a bit, but it was some much needed sleep. And I, overall, I am extremely satisfied with this strain. I am absolutely pumped to try some more of it, but I'm currently experimenting with some of the Yellow Manda, so that is what we're going to be talking about in the next video. But as for this particular strain, so far, absolutely amazing. I would rate it a damn good 10 out of 10 for a green vein. So if you would like to pick up some for yourself, then you can head over to ChristophersOrganicBotanicals.com to pick yourself up some right now.
So last night, I was editing a bunch of videos, and god, I was just so in the zone. Like, it would get to the point to where I would be editing a video for like hours and hours and hours. And it would just, I would just be so in it, you know? And it would just, uh, it was so blissful. So overall, the effects are just so uplifting, it's so euphoric. If you have any body pains, it'll certainly help with that, but I would imagine that maybe a red vein would probably help a lot more with that, but at least for me personally, it was amazing. My body felt absolutely wonderful. My mind was just in the zone. I got so much work done, and I just absolutely love this strain. I really do. Again, if you want to get some for yourself, then go over to christophersorganicbotanicals.com. This is my favorite major dry speciosa website, period. Granted, I do think that there is one other website that, whenever it comes to the potency of their Mitragyna speciosa, is actually a lot more potent. But it is also because they are selling certain extracts, and they're some of the most powerful that you can find online at the moment. So I will be doing reviews for them as well. In fact, I actually have a few of them already in the making, and some of them already done, so certainly keep an eye out for that. But yeah, just overall, just absolutely uplifting, very euphoric. My body feels amazing. I have so much energy. I have so many creative thoughts just flowing from my unconscious to my conscious mind. And the amount of shadow work that I've been able to do with the aid of Mitragyna speciosa is just absolutely incredible. I think that this plant is truly a miracle drug. I really do. I think that this is a miracle plant. Not just for the fact that it gets you so fucking high, because I mean, I love that too. But also, this is a medicine for the mind, the body, and the soul. And if you cannot understand that, then you, then I really don't know what else to tell you, because this is one of the most medicinal plants in the entire world. It really is. Granted, I do not think that everybody's neurochemistry and biological makeup will be in sync with this plant. I mean, there are some people who do not vibe with this plant whatsoever to the point to where they can just drink down like three grams of it and it just makes them sick, makes them throw up, doesn't make them feel well. Okay, that's fine. Not everybody's neurochemistry and biological makeup are a good fit for Mitragyna speciosa, but for those of us who it is, this is a miracle plant. It saves lives. It really does. And more importantly than that, it saves minds. Nonetheless, I do hope that you all enjoyed this video. If y'all did, leave it a like, subscribe to DMT Infinity if you haven't already, go over to ChristophersOrganicBotanicals.com and let them know that DMT Infinity sent you, and, as always, I'm your host, DMT Infinity, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace.